Welcome to this two-minute demo video of Provar Test Automation. We'll start by launching Provar's Test Builder. This Test Builder helps users build tests quickly in the browser. First, it will log us into Salesforce automatically using the connection details provided. We'll start by locating an Opportunity record. To add a step to the test, we'll right-click on the Opportunity name and select Add to Test Case. This will open a draft test step in the Test Builder. Note that Provar has recognised that we are on the My Opportunities list view and that we have clicked on the Name field. Because this data is in a table, the Test Builder offers a way to locate the row using a WHERE clause. This will help us avoid reliance on data which may change, for example in different environments. We can use multiple fields to locate the row or just one. This time we'll accept the default row locator as the name and the default interaction type as click. Then, we'll click Add and Do to execute the step in the browser. Now we'll add a product to the opportunity using the related list. Provar supports all related lists from metadata, so it recognises that we are on an opportunity record and that we are clicking the Add Products button. On the Add Products screen, we have another list of data which Provar recognises automatically. It has also recognised that we are clicking a checkbox, so it has provided a default interaction type of check. We can uncheck, toggle, and do other interactions too. Clicking Add and Do will execute the step. After mapping the next button, we can set a quantity for the product. By clicking Add and Do, we'll see the value set in the target field. Finally, we'll map the Save button to finish adding the product to the opportunity. We can then assert that the values are correct, or move on to testing other activities. We hope you enjoyed this demo of Provar Test Automation. To learn more, visit provartesting.com.